today we are going to talk about the different types of nephrons as we have previously discussed that nephron the nephron is the structural and functional component of the kidney and we discussed the different parts of the nephron in detail in our last lecture now there are some different types of nephron in the kidney although their structure is much the same but the depending upon their location they are basically classified into two main types the juxta medullary nephron and the cortical nephrons basically the juxta medullary nephrons are the nephrons with loop of henle that penetrates renal medulla deeply and cortical nephrons are the nephrons with loop of henle extending into the renal medulla outer region only so as we previously discussed the kidney structure that the outer part of the kidney is the cortex while the inner part is the medulla so the juxta medullary nephrons basically have a, are those nephrons who uh, in which the loop of henle basically penetrates deep in the medulla while the cortical nephrons are the nephrons in which the nephron loop of henle is penetrating in the medulla but not that much deeply the second thing is that the loop of henle is very long they have long loop of henle in the juxta medullary nephron so the juxta medullary nephrons have very long loop of henle while the cortical nephrons have shorter loop of henle or loop of henle so you see these are two different types of nephrons they are present in the same kidney the the the, the glomeruli of the cortical nephron is present in the renal cortex while the loop of henle is extending in the or penetrating in the medulla outer region only this is the outer region of the medulla this is the outer region of the medulla while the juxta medullary nephron has a loop of henle which is penetrating deep in the medulla so they have loop of henle penetrating deeply in the medulla and this is a long loop of henle while this is a short loop of henle now another difference between the juxta medullary and cortical nephron is that there is a large vasa recta there is a large vasa recta in the juxta medullary nephrons while there there is a reduced vasa recta in the cortical nephron now vasa recta is basically a special type of uh, capillary system which is surrounding which is surrounding these tubules which is surrounding these tubules and it is penetrating deep in the medulla these nephrons uh, these cortical nephrons they have a reduced vasa recta and that is a special type of capillary system which is surrounding in uh, the loop of henle so they have the uh, very established and large vasa recta while the cortical nephrons have a reduced vasa recta and vasa recta are basically specialized capillaries surrounding the loop of henle another thing is that the glomeruli of the juxta medullary nephron are present near the cortico medullary border now this is the cortex this is the medulla and the glomerulus is basically present around this border this is the border of the cortex and the medulla and the glomeruli the glomeruli of the juxta medullary nephrons are present near the border near the cortico medullary border so if we see this is the cortex the outer cortex here is the medulla and the glomeruli of the juxta medullary nephron are present somewhere here around the border of the cortex and medulla now the glomeruli of the cortical nephrons glomeruli of the cortical nephrons are present in the outer cortex so hit this is the cortex and the glomeruli of these cortical nephrons are present in the outer cortex while they they are basically present at the border now another difference is that juxta medullary nephrons have large glomeruli the glomerulus the glomeruli of these juxta medullary nephrons are quite large while the glomeruli of the cortical nephrons are small the glomeruli this is the glomerulus this is a basically a bunch of capillaries which is filtering the fluid in the bowman's capsule so glomeruli are larger in these ju uh, juxta medullary nephrons while smaller in the cortical nephrons then due to larger due to larger glomeruli they have high gfr the glomerular filtration rate so basically these glomerular filtration uh, these glomeruli they filter the plasma and the filtrate basically moves in these tubules and becomes a urine so they have larger glomeruli and they have higher gfr which is the glomerular filtration rate while the cortical nephrons they have a uh, small glomeruli and they have low gfr the glomerular filtration rate in these glomeruli is uh, very much less as compared to the gfr of the uh, juxta medullary nephrons now these nephrons the juxta medullary nephrons are only 15% of the total and the uh, cortical nephrons are around 80 to uh, 85% of the total so they may be around 15 to 20% of the total out of the, all the uh, nephrons around 80 to 85% are these cortical nephrons which are present the in the outer cortex region while only 15 to 20% are these long loop of henle type of um, nephrons which are the uh, juxta medullary nephrons now the function of these nephrons is also a little bit different although both the nephrons 
they perform uh, the normal functions, but these, there are only slight differences. So one big difference is in their location, but the other small difference is that these juxtamedullary nephrons, they play an important role in the concentration of urine. They play an important role in the concentration of urine and that role is played with the help of vasa recta. While these cortical nephrons, they play an important role in the excretory and regulatory functions. They are more important in excreting the urine. While these nephrons, they basically have the ability to concentrate or dilute. They will not dilute, but they have the ability to concentrate. And if they do not concentrate, the, the urine will be basically dilute. So they have an important role in concentrating their the urine. How these nephrons basically concentrate the urine? That is another important topic which we are going to discuss at proper time. But at this point, uh, we only need to know that the juxtamedullary nephrons, they have the glomeruli at the border of the cortex and medulla. They have long loop of Henle. The loop of Henle extends deeper in the medulla. They have larger vada recta. They have larger glomeruli. They have basically high GFR. They are only small in number and they have a role in the concentration of urine. While the cortical nephrons, they have their glomeruli are present high in the cortex. They have shorter loop of Henle. They have reduced vada recta. The glomeruli are present in the outer cortex only. They have small glomeruli, they have low GFR, they are higher in number. They are around 85% of the total nephrons and they have more, they are more important in excretory and regulatory functions. So that's all about the uh, different uh, types of nephron, the cortical and the juxtamedullary nephron. Thanks a lot for watching the video.